in January at the Delaware Standard Bread Owners Association's Awards Dinner, Lieutenant Governor Bethany Hall Long came out for the big night. Which is no surprise because she's a big supporter of harness racing and joins us every year for our banquet honoring First State Standard Bread Stars. Lieutenant Governor Hall Long, I love, love, love when you come to this banquet. But the cool thing is that I know that you love being here. I absolutely do. And thank you for having me on post time. She's remarkable. And announcer but not only because of your work and your ownership but the leadership that you give and there's nothing more important than being here tonight among the horsemen really important to our economy and as a young woman who was raised on a farm with all animals in Sussex and horses it is so important that we continue to honor and to really recognize the real importance of the horsemen to our community and all of those other service providers that they do business with, really important. Now, I, I have to say that I'm a little bit of a stalker on social media <laughs> when it comes to you. The thing that I love that you posted recently, so it was the picture of you when you're heading the General Assembly and you said, everything was just so positive and so much optimism and after having a couple of rocky years yes. i love that i love the excitement thank you a lot of good excitement coming out of covid you know i am a nurse i vaccinated 4,000 delawareans some of your uh, listeners but it is truly about being on the upside just like when we go in and we cast our uh, votes and when we're looking at who's going to win and the outcomes. It really is important. And so Delawareans need to know that our economy is coming back, but we need to recognize the support. And so to our local businesses, to the local horsemen, to our farmers, the ag community, as you know, Heather, this is critical. So again, delighted to be here tonight. I can't wait to see who's recognized. They're all winners to me. Some will take away trophies and plaques, but the scholarships that you give, really important for the education and the careers for our children too. So thank you and to thank you to all who support the horsemen. Now, um, saying that like I watch you all over social media, so of course I see you at small community events, big banquets, in meetings, signing things for legislation to be passed. Um, so I need uh, Bethany's best tips, I guess you could say. Do you clone yourself? How do you get from one place to another and stay happy and smiling? You know, when you love being among everyday Delawareans and we're working together, I get enthused like you do with the horsemen by being among people who really impact children's lives, our families' lives, so it's easy. And the secret is I love a lot of water and I have like a nice little wardrobe in the back of the car and so, that, a little coffee, a few eye drops, but sincerely, I think if you enjoy and have the passion, and I've been so fortunate as a House member, Senate member, now as your Lieutenant Governor, as we look into the future of Delaware, it's a strong time. And so it's easy to have positive energy, even though there's been a lot of negative, uh, that we have a lot more in common and a lot of good things to cover. Just like tonight, I think you'll have this shared sense of kindred spirit that is only unique to the horsemen and to all those who provide for them. Yeah, yeah. Uh, well, so we eye drops, wardrobe in the back, uh, water, water, a little cups, few cups of coffee. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. No, I love it. And next, next though, we're going to start to try to clone you. Then you can get a little more sleep, maybe. That would be great. <laughs> I wouldn't have to use the under eye concealer. Thank you. Oh Thank my you. gosh, I love having you on the show. Thanks. Thank you so much again Thank for you. being here and supporting our sport. Thank you so much to the best. Keep watching, keep supporting.